Hey, what's up guys, welcome back to the video, it's me Chris here and happy new year to everyone No matter where you are, I hope you're enjoying your time with your friends or family And 2020, it sucks, but I got to visit Japan, Hong Kong and met so many new people through Instagram and I did tons of photo shoot last year and of course I did a 2020 rewind video on my channel so you can check it out up here also I got 500 around 87 right now followers on TikTok because one of my videos blew up so quickly it was the sea cliff bridge which I did back in last month on the 20th of December I posted and then right now it's on 181.7k views which is amazing and on Instagram it got 16.9k as well on my um, profile which is great but it can be better but honestly it's still better than just a thousand or something like that so yeah it's been a great year and right now on Instagram I got 841 and right now on YouTube I got 315 subscribers so if you haven't subscribed make sure you click the subscribe button and today video I'm just gonna show you guys how I did my viral TikTok or Instagram real video using Femora 10 um, it's just basically a tutorial to teach you guys and give you guys some tips on how you can grow on TikTok and Instagram using those short videos and yeah let's get started Alright, so first of all you want to open Femora 10 and then you want to select 9x16 which is the portrait mode for your phone. Select new project. After that, import your videos. Click import media files and then go to your videos clip and import them. Here's a bonus tip to get more views on Instagram Reel or TikTok. All you need to do is find a trendy song on TikTok or Instagram Reel, any song from the trend list. For me, I like the one called In The End, so I just search up TikTok song in the end and then you download it online and then import it to Femora as well. Alright, so once you import it, your video clips and your background music, just drag it down to your timeline and then match the media if you want. I shot my drone shot at 4K resolution so I just have to match to the media at 30 frames per second. If you you can just do it whatever you filmed on maybe like 25 frames per second in 1080p that works as well. And then it'll go to wild screen mode which is 16 by 9. To change it in portrait you can find this logo right here which is a monitor. You click on it and then select change project aspect ratio and then right here you can select 9 by 16 in portrait mode and click OK but resolution normally I put on 4k so it's a bit more clear because even though Instagram Reel and TikTok will downgrade your video quality so it's better to do your best resolution and then click OK and you can see it just cropped in to make it fit into the frame to make it fit into the portrait mode right click your video clip and then select crop and zoom instead of right click you can just select alt c and then down at the ratio down here select 9 by 16 as you can see i got my sequel bridge on the left hand side to make it middle you just drag it along and then click ok and then it'll fit in into the frame nicely after that you just cut out the part you don't want Alright, so once you're done finishing editing all your video clips within the 15 seconds limit, which is easier to post on both TikTok and Instagram Reel, and then now you can drag your music down to the timeline, like that, and then cut it to 50 seconds. And yeah, that's 15 seconds already. If you have more footage that you want to show to your audience, you can make part 1, part 2, or part 3. Just split it in three different parts and then repeat the same process with the same song and then once you're done with your video and your background music you can go to the titles from the Femora section it provides many different options where you can use to make to write stuff for, to your audience to make it outstanding but normally I would write a simple sentence which will give a basic information about the location and how long it'll take to go there that location from Sydney because one day got the name they can just search it up and then plan their own trip 
after that you can just export it your video and then just you can do like C cliff bridge for the name and I just save it to my video folder and as I said I do 4k resolution because Instagram Reel and TikTok will downgrade my video anyway so so it's better to export it at your best resolution and then here's the size and here's the frame rate duration 15 seconds make sure it's 15 seconds because otherwise you can't show your whole video because the limit is 15 seconds for Instagram Reel but TikTok you can get up to 16 seconds which is good if you have more video footage but you don't want to split it apart and you just click export it and make sure it's mp4 folder and that's basically how I make my TikTok videos or Instagram Reel videos using Filmora X and right now I'll just show you guys some of the quick tips from me that can help you to grow faster on your TikTok or Instagram tip number one make sure you add hashtag in all your videos because that's how people find your video when they search up that hashtag for example when they want to search up C Clip Bridge they'll be able to find my video because I got C Clip Bridge in my hashtag speaking of hashtag a lot of people use FYP which stands for for you page which is a hashtag that will help you to grow faster more likes more followers more comment on TikTok I don't know if it works on Instagram real Tip number two, use trendy song that you can find on TikTok because it will help you to grow faster, get more likes and reach out to more audience. Tip number three, always use the new effects, games or filters from TikTok because when they first released, a lot of people want to know how would they look like so they search up that filters and then look up the videos. So you may be one of them if you use it when they first release. Tip number four, whether you're trying to upload to TikTok or Instagram Reel, always try to upload during peak hours because that's the time most people will go on their phone and scroll to your videos. Tip number five, if you want to grow faster, always keep up with the trend. Just follow the trend what they do, maybe like dancing videos or drone location videos, something like that. Just keep scrolling on TikTok and you find a trend and then you just do the same thing as them and you grow faster than you thought but most importantly do whatever you like because if you don't like it you will make it worse to be honest don't even try if you don't like it just do whatever you like and focus on it and yeah that's my top five tips on how you can grow faster on TikTok and Instagram if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit the like button and turn on that notification bell for more future videos coming soon. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you all on the next one. See ya!